Hey everybody, Tom Sparks with Sparks Media Group. I'm back from PMRE, and while I was there, QB Casa announced that they're now doing photo editing. So we're going to take a look at it and try it out. Okay, so here I have my QB Casa order history, and we're going to edit photos for this particular address, 1771 Beale Circle. We're going to click on the photo edit plus icon. And then, uh, let's see here, stylistic configurations. They have different clouds. You can add fire in the fireplace. You can add natural or exposed window pull. We'll try natural. You can green up the grass, do a grass replacement or enhancement. Uh, we're gonna pick no enhancement. Uh, and then we're gonna do, let's see here, we'll do front of house for the TV, if there is one. Actually, there's no TV in this house, so we're gonna put no enhancement. Um, and we'll keep brightness on boost. Put vacant house. And then we'll hit continue. All right, now we're going to drag and drop our files. I have, looks like 175 files, which are five brackets. Your photos are grouped by brackets for review, commenting, and add-on selection. All right, so 35 images, 175 to upload. We will hit continue. And it says here, um, turnaround time, 12 hour standard is free. First 25 photos are included. Additional 10 photos are 75 cents each. Let's see here, after submission, the cost for this order will be refunded. This refund will include 2D plus fees. Okay, grouping errors, all right, okay. We'll hit submit order. And now we should be uploading. Here you can see we are uploading. One thing I noticed off the the bat is that I'm not seeing a progress bar. So that would be helpful to show a total file count or how much is left so that we don't close out the window. Please don't close your browser. Okay, so we'll hit okay here. And it says uploading. So as soon as I get notification that um, the images are complete, I will come back and we'll review. All right, everybody, we're back in front of the computer and we got notification that our edits are done. So let's take a look at it. You'll see here it says ready under photo edit. And here we have the finished uh, photos, which are 35. Um, you can add more photos, you can do an order rating, you can do a change request. Let's take a look and see here.
So far, so good. Now, here it looks like there might be a little bit of an issue with the window pull. Here it's, it's a pretty clean line, but here it goes up. So um, that's image 44. Not bad. Did an overall uh, good job. Yeah, so we're going to go backwards and um, do a change request. I think it was this one right here, image 44, that I wasn't too happy about that part. So we'll do change request, and I'll say, let's see, I'll do image 44. Okay, type your notes. Specific um, okay, we'll hit save. And um, we'll close that out. Review change request. Okay. Submit change request. Okay. Uh, so now we'll go back to order history. And it says fixing. So we'll wait and see how they they handle that. Okay, everybody. So it looks like the edit is complete. We will take a look. And it doesn't look like they did anything to it. So let me refresh here. I'm going to download it and see if I can zoom in on this. So this is what I was talking about right here. And kind of this right here. And then right here. So I will put another request in. Uh, let's see here.
There we go. And we will, uh, it says fixing, so we will wait and come back and see what they say. Okay, everybody, we are back. It says that uh, the photo edits are ready. So now we're going to click here. And you can see that the window pulls look a lot better. So now we'll hit the download button. And we'll do, let's do the print version. Just getting ready to open the folder up. It downloaded them as a zip. And let's see here. We'll move this over. It looks like um, they're about, let's see, let's calculate this. About 10 megapixels each, roughly. Uh, so yeah. Here's all the photos. So drop a comment. Let me know what you think of the editing from Cubicasa. Uh, I was told I think these are human edits, not AI. Uh, but drop a comment. Let me know what you think. If you have any questions, feel free to um, leave them in the comments as well. Uh, if you find this video useful, share it. Give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, please do so. I'd greatly appreciate it. Thanks for watching.